this audience tonight will be part of that first audience that hears a brand new piece. There were certain things that did trigger those moments that, yes, this will be wonderful. We thought it would be good to explore the possibility of commissioning a brand new work, a brand new piece of music that could be played at this year's concert. We came up with the idea of commissioning a piece that would try and encapsulate the spirit of the castle over the last 900 years of its history. It's got to be a soundscape, something to describe the whole castle, the entire history. It's a magnificent place and it's one we, that we should cherish. I was thinking as I was walking around the castle, this would be a lovely piece for Lady Bailey, for instance. Imagined her looking out the windows, um, perusing the, the English countryside. And this thematic material came out with a lush cello sound. I could see Henry VIII chewing on a drumstick and their, their court musicians in the corner playing. Um, and then they'd be dancing. So all that, um, that, that influenced me effectively walking into the Great Hall. It was apparent from the earliest draft that what Tom was creating was quite a remarkable piece of music. It's all completely new, all the melodies are new, but they have a familiar feel to them. And I think it makes it sound incredibly cinematic, incredibly descriptive of such an incredible surrounding and such an incredible moment of history. John Rigby is such a remarkable musician. It's such a privilege and a pleasure to, to watch him in action and to actually interpret my music. Not every composer has the Royal Philharmonic Orchestra playing your music, so it is a privilege and an honour for them to actually perform it. I can't say it's not daunting having to conduct a world premiere, especially in front of over 12,000 people and in the presence of the composer himself. But also equally, it's thrilling. It's the first time that this piece will come to life with an orchestra. And what better orchestra than the Royal Philharmonic Orchestra to, to breathe life into it. So it's, it's both thrilling and daunting in equal measure, but I can't wait. I'm looking forward to it. I think it's going to be a fantastic opening to a very special event. I'll be with you tonight celebrating this wonderful anniversary. Um, I urge you just to take your eyes off the Royal Philharmonic Orchestra just for a little bit and glance over to the castle because there'll be some moments in the piece that you think, wow, this is fantastic. And also, let's raise a glass to celebrate 900 years history of Leeds Castle. I hope you enjoy the piece. <laughs> <laughs>